Last time, we defeated Zeo, we did some uh, side quests for the Hunter's Guild, oh, oops, what did I just do, I pressed the wrong button, confirm, yes, <laughs> and uh, yeah, now we're going into space to the satellite Zelen to talk to Ren about stopping the abnormal signals that have been messing up uh, with the environment of our planet, so that makes perfect sense, <laughs> that's, a, that's, a, that's an everyday sort of trip, and we've lost half of our party at this point, but <laughs> that's okay, this is like chapter two of the game going into space so yeah what could go wrong well, we, we've made serious progress and surely we'll just talk to him and I'll flip a couple switches and job done <laughs> the whole world is safe yeah okay not actually you know there's gonna be something going on I just got a canceller I don't know what that does a pulse laser a plasma field I think these are equipment for an Android I think Plasma Dagger, that's not for an android. Plasma s Claw, Plasma Sword. Yeah, we'll go ahead and equip some of those goodies. And definitely, oh, Plasma Field is a shield, apparently. I wonder if Rim can use that. There's the Plasma Sword for dude. Plasma Shield, no, okay. No super cool new shield for you there. I should have sold some equipment. Oh, it's my second Plasma Claw. There you go, Rika. You are plasmaed up. So, are you Ren? Is Ren here? Is there, there he is! <laughs> yes, Ren, yes. Wow, you're huge! Yeah, my name is Ren. This is a man-made satellite zone, which is, yeah, it's, yeah, we kind of already knew that. Control over all the environmental systems, the plans of the Algo Solar... So oh, it's not just our planet, it's all, every planet. Cool. And he manages it all. Oh, and he, oh, hi, Rika, that's so nice. Didn't know that you were so tall. <laughs> And okay, these are my friends Chaz and Rune. They're great pals. <laughs> uh, anyway, <laughs> glad to meet you. Demi told us that the reason the systems of Motivia are out of control could be found here. We've come to try to cure the problems, but from the looks of it, it doesn't seem likely. Oh, bad news. Oh well. <laughs> Zone is not causing the systems of Motivia to run out of control. We have no control at all. Oh, so Zone isn't working. Okay. Now what? <laughs> Presently, Zelen is lo oh, it's losing power. This is the artificial satellite Curin, Curin, Cur Curin, that is causing the Motivia system. Oh, so we just need to go to a different satellite, flip a couple switches, and job done. Originally, Curin was supposed to play a supportive role with Zelen, but somebody has occupied Curin and has usurped our control. Okay, since Zelen is at the top of the f chain of command, Demi must have determined that it's not. Okay, so Demi was wrong. Sad news, it's a good thing she's not in our party anymore. Uh, telecommunication functions have paralyzed. There isn't even a way to communicate. Uh, so we have to go there in, per in person. Got it. Uh, oh, yeah. And Ren, uh, Rika wants to know why Ren stopped talking to her. Because he doesn't like you, Rika. You are getting too needy. Too clingy. Uh, yes, go to Carrot Curry. It's good, good, good uh, conclusion there, Jazz. Oh, yes, you can come with us, Ren, definitely, <laughs> since we just got some equipment for you. Zelen is presently completely cut off from all the other systems. It is impossible to do any system restoration from here. I was hoping to go to Curran to get the situation under... Okay, good, yes, that was our whole plan. Oh, and Rika is looking forward to it. Okay, well... Oh, yes, Ren and Seed were my teachers. Oh... Okay. <laughs> uh, yeah, take responsibility, Ren, and I'm sure it's all your fault. Lots of talking. Wow, why don't we get a move on? Yes. Uh, yeah, okay. Quit, quit fighting, you two. You take charge if you can't. Oh, wow, those are fighting words. Okay, what's going on? Oh, this happens all the time. They're, they're just, just good pals, and we are going to rapidly put... Not equip Ren in front, because, like, uh... What's her name? Demi. He... Oh, and equip him while I'm at it. He, uh... Uh, yeah. Heals. Because he's an android. Pulse laser. Actually loses a lot of attack power with pulse laser. Did I get any other? Did I get another armor? I don't know. Was it for somebody else? 
Oh, it was the plasma field. Was it? Oh, the Chancellor was the other thing. Yeah. Anyway, so yeah, like Demi, he heals, so put him right in front. He's a lot tougher than Demi. Oh, so with this weapon, it uh, has a lower attack power, but it hits everybody. So that's pretty cool. So like, uh, like uh, Elise there, he's got a normal attack that hits everybody. And on our way to Curran. Now these four characters, oh. Oh. <laughs> Something feels wrong. Some good intuition there. There's an un unidentified energy reaction coming from the engine room. It's exploding! Cool. That's bad. <laughs> Way to sum it up, Rune. I, uh, yeah, I approve of that. Let's go see what's going on. Yes, and Chaz, I don't think you're much of a leader, so why do you keep complaining about Rune doing it? Yikes! Who are you? <laughs> oh my, I've been found out already. Yeah, already. Doesn't matter now whether sabotage the engines or kill you right here. Oh. Oh. Chaos Sorcerer, huh? Okay, so let's check out what uh, Duder here, Ren, does. He has recovered, it heals himself, flare that hits one target, spark and barrier we know already. We I guess we knew recover already too. So yeah, that's why I equip him with the attack that hits everybody, because he has flare to hit a single target when he needs to just hit a single target. I'm gonna go all out and murder this guy. This really isn't a mini boss. I mean, I guess it's a mini boss, but I don't remember it being any challenge whatsoever. Wow, that did a lot of damage to Ren. I was expecting high tech defense. Oh, so I was saying these four characters are the main characters of the game. If you watch the intro to the video, you'll see uh, pictures of all four of them. Gigra, who just won that? Must be Rune just learned Gigra. Um, <laughs> it's great that we won. Well, we're really out of commission now. Uh, couldn't you have applied a little bit of self-control? He did like one thing there, Chaz. Calm down. Um, you're in no position to talk. Rock the intended fly. Yeah, I, I expect so. <laughs> it's possible to get back into orbit. We will be able to make a crash landing on Desilus, the third planet of the solar system. Shall we try? Um, what do you mean, shall we? <laughs> we have no choice to do Okay, that's a good point. Um, one crash landing coming up. Oh, Rika's loving life here. Cool, huh? <laughs> and Chaz is not loving life. He is freaking out. Calm down, Chaz. You should endeavor not to let your blood pressure become too high. Why are you all looking so unconcerned? <laughs> and explosions. Yeah, so yeah, four main characters of the game. I won't lose any of these characters from now on. So that's pretty cool. In the intro, yeah, you'll see them. That's what I was saying. Third planet in the Algo solar system, it's, been, it's an extremely cold planet covered in snow and ice. So unlike Motavia, or Algo, yeah, Motavia, which is desert, Desolus is uh, snow and ice. So pretty much the opposite. And so, you know, the Watt attacks are extra strong on Motavia, and the Foy attacks are extra strong on Desolus. Good landing there, Ruin. <laughs> well done. We're safe, but wow, what a flamboyant landing. <laughs> That's one way to put it. How strange, it's raining machines. Yeah. Ah, uh, what on earth are you? Um, we're uh, not Desolus. Yeah. It's the first one I've. Yeah. So, yeah. That's Why wouldn't we would have ever seen one of them any other time there, Chaz? I mean. It takes space travel and all that. Oh, yeah. You destroyed an important temple. Oh, sorry, mister. Uh, <laughs> looks like we've crushed somebody's house. Who are you people? A girl with horns? A mechanical doll? Oh, ears. Yes. Android. Yes. Android. Got it. <laughs> you tell him, Rune. Uh, from Motavia, on a ship that flies, or flew anyway, but it fell, that's extraordinary. From Motavians flee, fly, and fall right on my temple hall. Glad you're enjoying yourself, Freak. <laughs> ah, shuttle's done for. Good news, so now we're just gonna live on Desolus. Game over, end of story. That's it, no, of course not. Uh, my name is Raja. Got it. Uh, <laughs> are there any facilities where we can fix this ship? No. Okay, game over. <laughs> How are we gonna fix this? 
I do have some welcome news for you. Yes. There's another ship that can travel the skies. Oh. Sweet! Replacement spaceship. That makes perfect sense. Uh, where is it? Okay, I'll tell you but on one condition. Is he drunk or something? Sounds interesting. Take me along. Okay, good. Good. Yeah, good. If you do, I'll overlook the destruction. Oh, totally worth it. <laughs> Otherwise, we'll be in debt for a very long time. What shall we do? Uh, Rika likes him. She likes everything, so. Don't think we have much choice. Seems a very practical choice. Turns out, actually, as it will, as you'll see, Raja is an amazing character to have along, so all of this uh, trepidation is totally uncalled for. A long, long time ago, Permanians? 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 Is that the first planet? Must be. Came here to Desolus on a ship that traveled the skies. It is said that the ship still exists in the town of their descendants. Cool. Of course it's true! <laughs> Uh, under the circumstances, we have no choice but to rely on the information we and go there. Which town? Tyler. Got it. Short distance northwest. All right, here we go. Um, I don't know what you're equipped with, but I don't like it. <laughs> force cane. I could equip him with a force cane. Oh, he uses canes, wands, whatever. I could equip him with the psycho wand. Increases mental power barely. Alright, well, first game it is. Side rogues won't help, so. I'm guessing there's all sorts of new equipment to buy now that we're on a whole new planet. Here we go. Hit me, snowstorm! This has been going on for three months now. This planet has always had a cold climate, but even I have never seen anything like this. Oh, malfunction in the Desolation climate control system. Uh, no, apparently. I bet it's caused all this. Oh, I bet the cause of all this lies in the Garuberk, Garuberk Tower. Raja, what makes you think that? It's a feeling. And my feelings are always good. I don't get it, no. Um, <laughs> Tamika thinks it's hilarious, though. Okay, so, we have Raja. Oh, and the snowstorm apparently is artificial. We have mixed opinions about what's causing it. Ryun? Rion? 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 Something like that. Oh, having fun here. Cool. Uh, yes, we do need to rest up. I don't actually... This is about the part of the game where my memory starts to fail me, and I don't actually know what there is to do <laughs> and what's a waste of time. I'm still not going to talk to everybody. I know there's somebody I need to talk to in one of these towns that's easy to miss. I don't think it's this guy, so <laughs> we won't bother. But yeah, you know, you know, yeah. We we would like a uh, yeah. There is one of these I need to actually go into. I think is it this place? Talk to you. First time. Oh, hello, Raja. In that case, I'll tell you anything. What do you want to know? Um, no, I don't want to know about the snowstorms. No, I don't want to know about the Garuberg. Power? No, I don't want to know about Raja. Yes, spaceship. <laughs> uh, underground in the town of Tyler. Don't know a lot about it, but apparently, if you take a good look at the grave, a path will open for you. Okay, I think I needed to talk to him. That's the secret to finding the spaceship. <laughs> but yeah, I would like to find a weapon shop or at least an armor shop here, like this. Turns out they only had gear for uh, Rune and Raja, but. I bought new armor for Rune, so that's nice. And I did sell a whole bunch of junk, including... Oh, here's some stuff. We'll show off some stuff, I guess. Uh, some snow animals. I don't actually know what I need to do to beat these guys. <laughs> so, Raja! Let's look at his. Blessing? I don't know what that does. Now's the very time to find out. We'll look at the rest later. <laughs> oh, wow. He died quickly. Um, wow. Okay, easy encounter, I guess. Oh, but I did sell a bunch of stuff, all that equipment that I had lying around, and also a uh, bunch of antidote, stuff like that. I'm pretty sure that's Tyler, but I'm not ready to go there yet. We, we, gotta, we gotta look around a little bit. Uh, we'll stick with Flaley. Let's keep the Flaley going. And I wanna see what Blessing does. Well, I'm gonna look at his stuff. Blessing is a buff, I'm guessing. Holy Word, I think it's a silence. 
that. Raxia, I have no idea what that does. Miracle brings somebody back to life. Uh, Sinkfire does damage to everybody. And then Rez, Brink Basar, Arrows. Yep, lots of. He is the designated healer. So, so, and the best healer in the game because he has absolutely no attacks. Wow, Ren, that's some serious firepower you have here. But yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna look around a little bit, see if there's oh, new stuff. Cool. <laughs> Let's see. I'm gonna just defend with you because why not? I want to see what his stuff does, because it's really important to know for boss fights what to use and which not to. Hopefully Ren won't kill them all here. Okay, that worked out. And Raja, he's actually really, really slow. Uh, defense power, okay, good to know. You defend, you defend, you attack, you defend, and we'll try Ataraxia. <laughs> this whole fight is just figuring out what Raja can do. Oh, heals everybody! Wow, well, not Ren, but that's really fantastic, actually. <laughs> mm, Raja, he is, uh, he is something special. So he has Sar, and he has that move for healing everybody. And he has Miracle for bringing someone back to life, and Reaver for bringing someone back to life, and he does have one attack, I guess, the Saint Fire. But, you know, you have to save that for the boss fights anyway. I'm sure there's other stuff to find somewhere. Or is this just a really short visit to Desolus and we have to come back later to sort out the snowstorm issues? That's a possibility. Should you just kill them? Yeah, let's just kill them. <laughs> there's a town. I can let loose everything I want here. There's a town that I'm pretty close to. Oh, double slash. That's not okay. Wow, these guys do massive damage. Oh, wow. Don't die, Rune. Thank you. That's very close. Uh, Ren, thank you. <laughs> wow, that was quite the, yeah, threat to my life. Oh, but I can show off the healing power of Raja. Let's heal Chaz with a G-Rez for 130-something. <laughs> heal Rune with a Rez for 70. Yeah, he's that good. And that's why... I was saying so much earlier in this LP that uh, using g res outside of combat was a waste because it didn't actually do twice as much, man. It's because of um, Raja. I was remembering Raja's power, healing power, prowess, potential. Um, wow, Raja, you just almost died. <laughs> it's not too late. Okay, please kill them. Thank you. That was, yeah, because Raja can go ahead and heal everybody with Rez for pretty much completely just by himself right there. It's impressive. It's almost a waste to right there. We are even going to heal Ren, too. He fell down kind of far and hasn't been healing himself quite, quite at the rate I want. Ooh, Sandworms. I wonder if I kill all but one of them if there's a... A, uh... I see sandworm, I meant snowworm. <laughs> I wonder if there's a giant snowworm that actually there isn't. I have checked that in the past. And it doesn't happen. I don't think. It doesn't matter. <laughs> it's very easy to kill. Uh, that may have something to do with the surprise attack fact. Uh, these guys are kind of annoying. I'm gonna stick to the game plan and just kill them as rapidly as possible. And maybe, you know, we'll drop a SAR. Why not? And they have to probably hit somebody in this way, whatever it is, unless it's Ren, <laughs> gets healed. Of course, if it's Ren, then it's kind of pointless, but... Ooh, Super Sonic! Wow, that's serious. Wow, Raja's so slow. Do not like Raja going so slow. You really want your healers to go quickly. Wow, my guy's got murdered with that combat. <laughs> um... The first random encounter I had on this planet was such a pushover that I figured I was kind of over leveled for this area, but it turns out these guys are. Man, where am I going? <laughs> the snowstorm seems to be getting thicker, too. These whiteout conditions. I should have. Is there nothing over here? Did I seriously just come all this way just to stare at a stone wall mountain ass waste of time area place? <laughs> That's a good description. Wow, how come he only did one damage with that attack? I don't know, but I'm glad, because 
I, I am afraid for... Though I really shouldn't be, because I have Raja now, and he can bring people back to life no problem. Oh, and I guess Rune can do it too. So, yeah, you know, yeah. She's not as good at it as as uh, Raja is. Apparently I'm just filling up this little <laughs> this video with random encounters. Um, sorry about that. I'll start cutting them out after this, but you know, four worms and uh, I'll go ahead and kill them like I killed all the rest and take a whole bunch of damage and have to heal myself again. Wow, man, you, you need to not miss. So yeah, this whole combat is just waiting for Rune to take his turn <laughs> so he can use his power to hit everybody. Uh, I gotta remember how to get to uh, Raja in this menu as quickly as possible. One more res. He has a lot of tech points. That's really handy. Yeah, um, yeah. this totally was just a dead end. What do you know about that? <laughs> Good waste of time. Oh yeah, I was saying earlier I should have uh, just uh, stepped into Tyler so I could teleport back. Oh, and you know what I can do? All of these um, random encounters. Could have just used the Land Rover. <laughs> It would have had other random encounters, but I wouldn't have been so beat up. Okay, here we are to Tyler. And these are human-looking people. Unlike the Rion, or whatever it was. Spelled like, pronounced like, whatever. Um, there's an item shop. There's a weapon shop with new armor for everybody. That's very nice. They had uh, didn't have any good weapons. Nothing better than what I have. I'm sure I need to talk to somebody in here. Yes, I am he whom everybody calls the old man. This is a place where the Parmesians first landed when they moved to Desolus a long time ago. It's been said that they named this town after the captain of the spaceship they came on. The story goes that they built a grave on the outskirts of the town in memory of the captain. Got it. So I need to go look at that grave. I'm not sure if I actually needed to talk to him. But yeah, anyway, new armor for everybody, so that's really good. I only barely had enough, uh, 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 cash for it, actually. <laughs> um, and I bought new shields for Rune and gave his old shields to Raja, so. Raja has shields now, so he can't attack anymore. <laughs> Great leader Tyler, touch us, listen to our voice, and trust that body to us, so this is Tyler's grave. Hmm. Guna. I don't know who Guna is, but anyway, I said to inspect this grave closely. Oh, that's who. Okay, never mind. But I don't see anything. There's just an inscription. Ah, the plate just moved. Okay. And success. Maybe there's a spaceship down there. Let's go see. Hey, you think? <laughs> oh, good. Another dungeon for more random encounters. That's what I haven't had enough of in this video already. Snow Slug, he's probably a bad man. He, he may actually... I don't remember if there's a boss at the end of this, but I'm going to assume there isn't and regret it if I find out that there is. So now, funny thing, <laughs> Raja doesn't actually have anything to do in these battles, so he'll just defend. Fortunately, the other four guys are all very combat-oriented. So. Oh, turns out Snow Slugs... Oh, they don't give me any experience or cash at all. Turns out they don't really matter. Zermic gear. I don't know what Zermic stands for. But, there you go. New helmet gear thing for uh, Ren. And now we have some toads. Giant toads. Let's, uh, let's put up our guys like this. And yeah, another great thing about having Raja on our team is that Rika can focus on Attacking instead of healing. Well, that's the theory, but in truth, uh, she still you need more than one healer. <laughs> so, so she still does plenty of healing. Now three toads this time, but surprise attack. So I don't even need to do anything extra with anybody. We'll just go ahead and slash him and defend and shoot everybody. Thank you for not missing any of them, Ren. Wow, none of them died. That's embarrassing. And here I was so confident that I didn't need to. Here, let's. Let Rune do a hewn to finish off whatever other people miss and mess up on. And oh, wow! There, my whole team is asleep. It's okay, Ren can <laughs> take them out. I don't think that a status element lasts, so we're good. We're good. 
and we're gonna wander around and see I really don't like I said this is all where my memory fails me I have no idea where I'm supposed to be going but yeah no no I think I'm doing it right I found two treasure chests and yeah this seems to be going the right way. okay yeah that worked really well actually so my memory still works wow amazing so this is a spaceship the Marisian used yes we've already established that an emblem Landale cool it's called a Landale what a cool name an air going barge a space sled what are you talking about don't ignore me if you spoke reason we might not be ignoring you I preserve it almost perfectly with a little maintenance could be perfectly useful maybe if you're saying perfectly twice it's kind of annoying sure are in luck yes take off Roger so yeah that's Daedalus we'll be back but um not yet and I think we're taking Raja with us even weird huh um, let's go check out Curran. I have a little bit of time. Don't have enough time to finish it, of course, but... Oh, and I can go back to Motavia. That's interesting, but we don't want to. We just want to go to Curran. Blast off! So, yeah, in one video we used one spaceship and destroyed it and found another spaceship. That feels like progress. It feels, it feels like, even though it really isn't, <laughs> we've done basically nothing. <laughs> It feels like, you know, because we were, we're still, you know, we set off to go to Zelen to fix the transmissions, and we're still trying to fix the transmissions. We're just someplace else. So this is the artificial satellite current that has sent the entire planetary control system out of whack. Um, yeah, that's because you're probably drunk, still. It's a good thing he's coming with us. Let's turn to the main control center. Yeah, what are you so mad about, Raja? So, unlike the other satellite, this place is huge and deadly. And wow, Raja just got hammered. Um, that's not good. I may need to trade who has which, uh, uh, shields. Because, <laughs> wow, that was a lot of damage. How much damage am I going to be able to do in Rune? It's totally fine. So, yeah, we're going to switch that out. <laughs> yes, that was the most useful thing I could do with Raja in this place. But that's why I gave him shields, because he, uh, yeah, his attack power is so weak. <laughs> and, uh, um, yeah, his defense is pretty weak himself. So it's not worth being able to attack with him. There we go. That's much better. Um, do I need to heal anybody else? So, yeah, just give him shields. So it's, yeah, Chad, see, he's okay, though. I think it's about time to end this video, so we'll one last battle, and I probably shouldn't waste my hand. Eh, well, yeah, yeah, we'll waste it anyway. Uh, Siren, yeah. Everybody, this has been <laughs> Bertador playing Fantasy Star Four. One more week down. We're making progress, but yeah, we're not even close to finishing this game. Thanks for watching.